What is up, Grisbro Nation? How are all of you doing? It is finally here. Cosmic Eclipse has been released, at least in some pre-release events. I'm so excited about all these cards on videos I'm seeing. And also, when I went to the pre-release event myself, uh, I had a blast. I ended up going 4-1 and one and won a bunch of extra packs. I didn't get any crazy pulls. I did get the Pikachu... Uh, secret rare, which is really nice. I got the Stoutland uh, secret rare, which is really nice. And then I also got this bad boy. Look at that amazing product. I am so excited to open this. The other cards I got from the pre-release was this Fion uh, Cosmic Eclipse promo. The Mallow and Lana. Switch your active and heal when you switch out if you discard some cards. And this gorgeous Arceus, Dialga, and Palkia GX alternate art GX. That is such an amazing GX move. Being able to add 30 more damage for the rest of your game. And if you have an extra water, you get to take an additional prize card when you knock out one of their Pokemon. That is definitely what helped me win a lot of those matches. So, with nothing further ado, I'm going to go ahead and open up all of these packs. I'm going to open up this first booster box of the Grizzbro Gaming Channel. If I can at least get the plastic wrapping off. There we go. I am at least getting through it. All right. So, with this, I am obviously hoping for some of the rainbow cards. Uh, my little brother is already doing great. Uh, he has one video up so far of the pre-release boxes he purchased, uh, the actual, you know, build and battle ones, and he got some crazy good pulls so far. Uh, go check out some of those videos. This is a very exciting time for, uh, for us Pokemon card collectors. So, obviously these codes aren't good yet, so I am going to hold on to them and I'll start giving some away when uh, the game actually allows you to add them. So, Araquanid, Throw, Dartrix, Palpitoad, Cricketot, Apum, a Woobat, Ducklet, there's a Reverse Hollow, it is an Ursa Ring, and the non holographic rare is a Trevenant. You may have your opponent switch their active Pokemon with one of their bench, okay, and put four damage counters on one of your uh, Pokemon for 120. All right, next pack. Got that Solgaleo Lunala uh, cover art. That is just absolutely beautiful. That would not be a bad pull to get. I've tried really hard to not look at uh, the set list for this. Ooh, nice. Tag Team, Bella, Bell Elba, and Bryson, man. Discard three cards from the top of each player's deck. When you play this card, you may discard three other cards from your hand. If you do, each player discards their benched Pokemon until they only have three left. Opponent discards first. That is a crazy tactic. There is a Probo Pass. Igly Buff, which is a star in one of these cards. Sleepy Voice, okay. Pikachu. Teddy Ursa, Nose Pass, Lit Leo, Flabebe, Reverse Hollow is the Passimian, and a Drompa with Dragon Claw, which is really cool for that new uh, GX. Uh, I forget what it's called. You can attach it to a Pokemon that has Dragon Claw and allows it to do a GX move. Uh, Z Crystal, maybe? All right, one, two, three, four, just like always. Brink, Psychic. All right, got the Rotom. Type Null, very cool. Heracross, Oddish, Rufflet, Piplup, was definitely a main feature in these pre-release events. Alolan Vulpix, nice. Rockruff. Reverse Hollow is a Whale Lord and another non-holographic rare, but this one is Cradilly. 
Swaying Strangle. Your opponent's Pokemon that are affected by special condition cannot retreat. Very cool. And its attack ensures that it will have a special condition. All right, this is the Blastoise Piplup artwork. Okay. One, two, three, four. Fire. Pangoro. Rapidash. Vibrava. Carvanaw. Tepig. Definitely was another one featured. Togedemaru. Onyx. Whalmer. Reverse is a Slurpuff, and it's actually reverse rare. That's pretty cool. And... <gasps> Holy crap! Rainbow Rare Flygon GX Dusty Defense, as long as this Pokemon is your active, all of your opponent or all of your Pokemon take 30 less damage from your opponent's attacks. Desert Hurricane does 120 plus. If there's a stadium card in play, it does 120 more, but you have to discard the stadium. And Sonic Edge does 220 damage, not affected by any effects on your opponent's active Pokemon. Wow. That is quite a pull. That is exciting. I'm going to go ahead and put that right on over there. Wow. That's my first Rainbow Rare from this set. And I will not forget it. Flygon. Very cool. All right. Two, three, four. If you guys are here at the premiere, thank you so much for being here. We really do appreciate it. We try uh, very hard to get out good content, new content, as often as we possibly can. But we definitely try to at least give out some good content. Uh, Hakamo O, Ralts, Pissimian, Jangmo O, Rowlet, a Screlp, reverses a Swirlix to go along with that Slurpuff, and a non holographic rare Braviria, or Braviary, excuse me, Clutch, defending Pokemon can't retreat again. And Aerofall, you have to discard two energies to do the 140 damage. Okay. One, two, three, four. Hopefully you guys, uh, if you were able to go out to some of the pre-release events, I hope you guys got some good pulls, had fun doing the uh, miniature tur tournaments. That's a very good uh, Pokemon tool, that Beastite. Lily, uh, Jolteon, Ponita. Sunkern, Cosmog, Psyduck, Trapinch to go along with that Flygon. Reverse Hollow is a Helioptile, which looks actually really cool as a Reverse Hollow. And a non holographic rare Sunflora. I, I haven't seen a Sunflora in a long time. Uh, ignore all energy in the attack cost of Grass Pokemon during my next turn. Oh, and Fire Pokemon. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's the move. Uh, and then Solar Beam, so. For two colorless, you can use the uh, sol solar beam for uh, for two. That's pretty cool. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm just putting them all there. Sorry. <laughs> Trying to make sure my organization doesn't go too crazy while I'm making this video with 36 packs. I sometimes uh, lose track of cards. All right, one, two, three, four. If you guys did go to a pre-release event, tell us how you did. Tell us if you guys got some good pulls, if you guys went far in the tournament. It's always fun to hear. There's the Vibrava to go with that Flygon. That is just awesome. Probopass, Deerling, Teddy Ursa, a Golit, finally got released in Pogo, Dewpiter, another Helioptile. <gasps> yes! Secret Rare Torkoal. Look at that. Fire Fling, put four energy cards from your discard pile into your hand. Kindle, discard an energy from this Pokemon, but if you do, you get to discard an energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. Wow, that is gorgeous card. And, oh, more! Oricoco GX. Dance of Tribute once during your turn. If any of your Pokemon were knocked out during the last turn, you may draw three cards. Very cool. Uh, Razor Wind does 80. Strafe GX does 100. Switch this Pokemon with one of your bench. That's definitely a last resort kind of move. Wow, let's get these bad boys into sleeves. There's the Ori Coco. And wow, the secret rare Torkoal. Look at that. I got to say, uh, a lot of people are giving the yellow borders some shade. But, you know, it doesn't bother me. It really doesn't. 
I think it you know makes the artwork pop out. Although obviously the uh, the silver does look nice too. All right. One, two, three, four. This is exciting, guys. I'm so I'm so happy to be doing this. Fairy, getting a getting a box this early. I mean, it's 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 a blessing. Honestly, it's so cool. Golduck. There's Will. Okay. Mimikyu. Very cool being able to use an attack. Uh, discard a supporter card from your hand and you get to use it as the effect of the attack. That's very cool. Lillipup. Trapinch. Sneasel. Water type using a darkness energy. Oh, dropped it as I talked about it. There's the Sfeel. Alolan Meowth. Alolan Vulpix. Reverse. And... A Fion, very cool. That was the promo I got. Now I have two of them. That is very cool. Man, there's just so many packs left. This is crazy. Two, three, four. I mean, like, I want to go fast for, you know, being able to make the video shorter, but at the same time, like I said, these aren't cards I've seen. I've tried really hard to stay away from them. Cynthia and Caitlin. I don't really like this card. I read it. I got it uh, in the pre-release. You have to discard three more cards, uh, to, or discard another card from your hand to draw three. And you get to put a supporter back from your discard to your hand. Uh, maybe if you're also playing a Lieutenant Surge, it'd be worth using that turn. Jolteon, Pangoro, Eevee. Duskall was huge in the uh, pre-release, being able to Disable it at stage two, evolving right away, and then uh, Dust Noir had a really good attack, 60 plus 60 next turn. Full Bebe, Alolan Sandshrew, Reverse is a Drill Burr, and nice, there's my first holographic rare. It is a Lycanroc. Uh, if your opponent has any GX or EX in play, this Pokemon's attacks cost three less. Oh my god, just in play. If your opponent's active Pokemon has any special energy attached to it, it does 70 more. So 60 for free, though, if they have a GX out. Very cool. All right. Keep on chugging along. One, two, three, four. Darkness. I'm telling you, I think that dark box is going to get really good with some of these cards. I'm looking forward to it. Clefairy, another Apum, Litleo, Coughing, Nose Pass, Snow Runt, Rock Ruff, Reverses a Toganamaru, and another Ursaring, this time just regular rare. Alright. There's those uh, triple babies. Very cool fairy card. I did see it in the uh, pre-release. Somebody pulled it, but uh, you know it, it wasn't able to do very much. The flipping of coins did help it a lot, but I'm telling you that Arceus is a beast. Stuffle, Rowlet, Phantom, Magnemite. Ooh, reverse rare Black Curum and a a non-holographic rare Revile. That's very cool. Water pack. Speaking of water, Blastoise Piplup Pack. One, two, three, and four. If you guys are here for the premiere, uh, looking for codes, I'm gonna try to give some out. I think I still have some uh, Unified Minds sitting over there, so I'll try to I'll try to hand those out if I'm uh, able to. There's a Chinchu. There's a Cosmog, Pancham, Drillbur, Tangela, ooh, Reverse Holographic Clay. Discard the top seven cards of your deck. If any of those cards are item cards, you get to put them in your hand. Very cool. And another Slurpuff. About five packs away from the end of the first half of the video. Like always, I'll take a quick break. It'll be one second for y'all. 
couple minutes for me and uh, just sort my cards over here real quick. There's a Will, a Lillipup, a Skrelp, Pikachu, Stuffle, Ponyard. Nice! Reverse Holographic Beastite. Very cool. Love it. And... Oh my gosh! Yes! I got the, the full art Blastoise and Piplup GX card. That is absolutely beautiful. Look at that. That is so pretty. Splash Maker does 150. You get to attach up to three energy cards from your hand to your Pokemon any way you like. And for each one you attach that way, you can heal 50 damage onto that Pokemon. Bubble Launcher GX does 100. Three extra waters attached to it. Uh, it'll do 150 more. Uh, no matter what, though, it does paralyze them. So, Very cool card. Oh, my goodness. A Secret Rare. A GX. A Rainbow Rare. A Full Art. This has been amazing. An amazing first half of a booster box. Alright. Sorry about hitting the camera there. Darkness energy again. I like it. Delmize. There's the stadium. This is I think this might be the only stadium in here. I've opened uh, maybe seven or eight of these packs from the pre-release. And this was the only one I saw from anyone. Chaotic Swell. Which pretty much just canceled out the next stadium played. Uh, Trapinch. Oddish. Rufflet. Piplup. Alolan Vulpix. Ooh, nice. A reverse holographic Victini. Once during your turn, you may heal 20 damage from one of your bench Pokemon. And Combustion does 30. And a Weezing, non holographic. All right. Very cool. Yeah, I really like the artwork from the from this set on the packs and the cards. It's just all done really nicely. There's a Flareon, Roller Skater, very good card. Clefairy, Woobat, Ducklet. Still looking for another tag switch. I need one more. I got two from the pre-release. Alolan, a Slugma. There's a Reverse Ducklet and ooh, a rare Mimikyu. Pokemon GX that have any damage counter on them have no abilities. That's really cool. Wow. If I can get any damage on a Keldeo, have him on the bench, he's done. He's done. Very cool. All right. There's that Blastoise Piplup I just got. Wow. I cannot believe I got Blastoise Piplup and a Rainbow Flygon. Secret Rare Torkoal. Oricoco. This has been awesome. There's a Guzma and Hala. Search your deck for a stadium, reveal it. If you discard two more, you can get a tool and a special energy. Vaporeon. There's the tag call. Nice. Look at that. That's exactly what I needed as far as uh, items go. That's awesome. Natu. Trapinch. Sveal. Passimian. Rowlet. Magnemite, Reverse Hollow, and a Marshadow Rare, Shadow Imitation. Choose one of your opponent's active Pokemon's non-GX attacks and use it as this attack. Okay, so as long as it's a non-GX attack, you can use it for three energies. Second to last pack on the left side of the booster box. Three, four, I think I did four. Jeez, I hope so. Fire, okay, I did. Whew. Tropius, Togemaru, Absol, Alolan Sandshrew, Ponita, Sunkern, Cosmog, Psyduck. <gasps> Secret Rare Gallade, look at that. Double type, as long as this Pokemon is in play, it's Psychic and Fighting type. That's amazing. I mean, that's fine as an ability. I do wish they would have done the double, uh, you know, how they did with Azuril and those kind of cards. I did like that that uh, aspect to a card. But making it an ability is the same concept. It's just, uh, I like to see the two types up there. I don't know. But that's very cool. 
Power Cyclone, two colorless, 120 damage. Move an energy from this Pokemon to one of your bench Pokemon. I mean, that can go in any fairy deck and be able to be used for uh, psychic and fighting if they need it. That's crazy awesome. And a holographic Dust Noir, which, like I said, was very heavily used. If it gets hurt, you get four damage counters on uh, opponent's Pokemon any way you like. And after your first turn, Psych Up will do 120. Very cool cards. I'm going to get these into sleeves really quick. Put that over there by the Lycan Rock. And Gallade will go by Flygon. Wow, that is a beautiful card. Card 244 out of 236. All right, last pack of this side, and then I'm going to take a quick break. It does have the Solgaleo Lunala artwork on it. Let's see what we can get from it. One, two, three, four. All right. Grass Energy. Gloom. Floet, which we still haven't seen the other uh, AZ Floet given out. Zangoose, Onyx, Whalmer, pa Palpitoad, Cricketot, Apum, Reverse is a Zangoose, and a Heliolisk Rare, which I have not gotten yet, so that's very cool. Parabolic Counter, if your opponent has any Electro Pokemon to play, it does 90 more damage. Very cool cards. All right. Give me one moment, I'll be right back. All right, I am back. So, I have some code cards out here for you guys. Uh, there's a couple tins, couple regular codes up there for Unbroken Bonds. Those are the cards that I got on the first half. Flygon GX, Blastoise Piplup, Torkoal, and Gallade, Secret Rares, Oricoco GX, and a couple regular holographic rares. Really cool pulls for the first 16. I'm going to go ahead and dig in to this last half of the booster box. Starting off with this Baby Trio artwork pack for the front. Fighting. Another tag call. There we go. A Delmize. Another Chaotic Swell. A Lowland Grimer. Magnemite. Eevee. Flabebe. Sneasel, Reverse is a Cosmog, and a non-holographic rare, Mag Cargo. All right. Oh, put those in the wrong pile. There you go. Pack number two. I hope you guys are enjoying this video. Uh, definitely check out the mini-series my little brother is doing. Uh, like I said, with uh, pre-release boxes, he's going to be opening a bunch of those. It's very exciting. There's a Curlia to go along with that Gallade, Bisharp, Torkoal, Tangela, Eevee, Duskull, a Timple, another Flabebe, the reverse is a Torkoal, and the non-holographic rare is an Alolan Muck with that Panic Poison active Pokemon is Burned, Confused, and Poisoned. Very cool card. All right, there's the uh, Dialga Palkia artwork. Should have just thrown Arceus on that artwork somehow, but I understand. They're pretty big Pokemon. Another Darkness, Floet, Zangoose, Vaporeon, Dewpiter, Helioptile, Carvanal, Tepig, a Togedemaru, Ooh, Reverse Holographic Rare is a Groudon, and <gasps> another Flygon! This one is the regular GX. Look at that. That is awesome. Very cool card. I like the artwork. I like the colors on Flygon popping from the dark, or from the uh, orange in the background. Very cool card. All right. Already went over his Dusty Defense. Ability, which is very cool. Okay, Psychic. Ooh, a Mallow and Lana. Another one. That's awesome to go along with my uh, full art one. A Clay. A Cricketune, which was definitely in the decks, but it was very hard for a lot of players to get down to one card. Obviously, there's a lot of discard options. 
uh, in this set, but it was still rather difficult just because it's a 40 card deck in the pre-releases. Sandy Gast, Sveal, Cottony, Rowlet, Phantom, a Reverse Hollow Cosmog, and a non-holographic rare Sylveon. Moonblast, uh, during the next turn, it does 30 less, or the opponent does 30 less damage to Sylveon. Beloved Pulse does 80 plus. If you played a tag team supporter from your hand during this turn, it does 80 more damage. So if you switched into this using the Mallow and Lana uh, during, your, during that turn, you would be able to take 160, or yeah, 160 damage uh, just for three energies on a one prize card. Very cool. Some very cool fairy cards in this deck. Okay. One, two, three, four. Grass. A Bisharp. Torkoal. Gloom. Slugma. A Chinchu. Have not seen that one yet. There's the Cosmog that I just got the reverse of. Panchum. Drillbur. Nice. A reverse art for Will. Or, yeah, Reverse Hollow for Will. And a Swana. Have not seen that one either. Attach an energy card from your hand to one of your Pokemon. And Air Slash does 70, but you have to discard an energy from this Pokemon. Okay. Hopefully this uh, right side picks up. So far, obviously, the left side is winning. I think even this far in, it, was, it would have been too. Steel. Celio. Nice. There's a draw energy. That's a good card to have. Cosmom. Have not seen that one yet. Stiffen during your opponent's next turn. This Pokemon takes 40 less damage. That's good to get it prepped up in case you actually have to put it out there. Snowrunt. Rockruff. Deerling. Teddy Ursa. A Golit. Ooh. Reverse holographic rare is a Glalie. Ice Fang. Uh, if heads, opponent active Pokemon is paralyzed and discard an energy from that Pokemon. Wow. Uh, Frosty Typhoon does 120, but it can't use it during the next turn, so you're going to have to use Icy Fang if it's still out there. And, ooh, nice! Vile Plume GX with Erica in the background. A bunch of flowers everywhere. Fagrant Flower Garden. Once during your turn before you attack, you may heal 30 damage from this from each of your Pokemon. Wow! From each of your Pokemon. Massive Bloom does 180 negative. Uh, this does 10 less damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. So the weaker it gets, the weaker the move will be. An Allergic Explosion GX, which you guys can tell I am getting the fall allergies right now. 50 damage. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now burned, paralyzed, and poisoned. Wow. That's really cool, especially if you know Five Bloom's about to get knocked out. You might as well use that. Uh, allergic Explosion GX move. Very cool pool. Always nice to see the new GXs and be surprised by them. You know what I don't really try to hide from? is spoilers for Pokemon Sword and Shield. I've been eating those up. I'm sure all of you guys know by now what some of the uh, new stuff being implemented in them are. What, do you guys, what are your guys' thoughts? Do you guys have any thoughts on it? Are you guys excited? A little mel melancholy about it. That's kind of where I'm at. Oddish. I can't believe they made Long Cat into an actual Pokemon. There's Ralts. Ooh, reverse of that Sylveon I just got. And nice, a holographic rare Exadrill. That is a very cool card. 11th hour tackle, 30 plus. If there are three or fewer cards in your deck, this does 150 more damage. Wow. And then Drill Bazooka does 120. Discard the top four cards of your deck. Okay. Put him all the way to the right over there. Hoping for some in between to cover up them codes. I'm sure you guys have already gotten them. Uh, like I said, there was like a GX10. Two GX uh, Hidden Fates 10s and uh, two Unbroken Bonds. There's an Electric. An Unidentified Fossil. A hakamo O. A Herdier, Apem, Woobat, Ducklet, 
Swirlix, Alolan Grimer, Sfeel, Reverse Hollow, and a Seismitoad, non-holographic rare. Once during your turn, you may search your deck for a card, shuffle your deck, then put that card on top of it. Very cool, especially if you have another Pokemon that will draw the next card uh, or item. Tumultuous Fist is 80+. plus. This attack does 30 more damage for each of your bench Pokemon that has any damage counters on it. Very cool card. Last card from the uh, first stack. So that means I have eight more, I think. Was that right? Yeah, I have eight more packs after this. One, two, three, four. Boy, this is exciting. I love this. Fire Energy. Another Celio. Nice, another Draw Energy. Put that over there. Cosmo. Stuffle. Ponyard. Litleo. Coughing. Nose Pass. Reverse Hollow is a Pancham. And a Whale Lord. All right. One, two, three, four. What's, what's the energy going to be? I'm going to just say darkness. It's kind of been theme of the night. All right, fighting. Exact opposite. Dusclops. Professor's Oak setup. Professor Oak's setup, excuse me. Very good. I'm glad that's back. Pig Knight. Piplup. Cosmo, Cosmog. Ponita. Cribrawler. Carvanaugh. Spoiler alert. A Lolan Sancho reverse holographic and a Whimsicott. Uh, Lost March does 20 damage for each of your Pokemon except Prisms that are in the Lost Zone. Look at that. Fairy Lost March. Bringing it back. All right, one, two, three, and four to the front. Steel. Nice, Misty and Lorelei. This is a really crazy card. Search your deck for up to three energies, reveal them, put them in your hand, right, and shuffle your deck. When you play this card, if you discard five other cards from your hand, if you do, during this turn, your water Pokemon can use their GX attacks, even if you've already used your GX attack. So you can get off two GX attacks in one game if you use this. Maybe, maybe multiple, I wonder what the ruling would be. It doesn't say you can only use one of these a game, so, yeah, that's crazy. Hakamo-O, Herdier, Togemaru, excuse me, uh, Onyx, Whalmer, Palpatode, Cricketot. <gasps> yes! I got the Steelix Secret Rare. This is awesome. I was very much looking forward to this one. I did see this one get pulled, and I was like, man, that's a beautiful card. Look at that, Thumping Fall 50 times. Discard any number of Pokemon with a retreat cost of exactly four from your hand. It does 50 for each card you discard this way. Uh, Iron Tail does 100 times. Flip a coin until you get tails. Uh, it does 100 times each heads. Very beautiful card. And, <gasps> oh my gosh! Guzma and Hala, full art. Look at that pack. That is a awesome pack. That is crazy. That Guzman Hala. I'm going to have to figure out what it's going to be used in. Because I don't know many decks that you're going to be running tools, special energies, and a bunch of stadiums. But that is still an exciting, exciting pool to get. Look at that. Wow. And that Steelix Secret Rare. Just uh, if you guys aren't aware. I mean, you guys are probably... But the Secret Rare will occupy the Reverse Holographic spot. That's why I've been a little slow uh, revealing the Reverse Holographic so far. Is because that is where the Secret Rare will be. Uh, almost similar to Hidden Fates. Where the uh, Shiny Vault would have been. There's another Darkness. A Vibrava. Theme of the Night. Great Catcher. Very good card. There's that Dragon EMZ I was talking about. Being able to use the Destructive Drake. The one that I saw from this deck that you can use it with is Drompa, which did help me in the pre-release. One time my Arceus was uh, prized, so I was able to get off the uh, Destructive Drake. 
uh, Persimian, Rowlet, Lillipup, Skrelp, Pikachu, Great Catcher, Reverse Hollow. First time I got Great Catcher in any pack, and I get two of them, one being a reverse, and a Zatu. Creepy Wind, opponent's active Pokemon is confused. Life Drain, flip a coin. If heads, put damage counters on your opponent's active Pokemon until its remaining HP is 10. Wow, for one prize card, you can really take a lot of damage if you get that heads. Wow, that's crazy. Five packs to go. This has been such a great booster box. So many good pulls. All right. Finally got that finagled out of there. Four. Fire. Professor Oak. Pignite. Unidentified Fossil. Trapinch. Flabebe. Tangela. Another Duskull. Temple. Gloom. Reverse. And another Drompa. All right, I'll take it. Like I said, there's that Dragon Claw move. Uh-oh. Don't fall out. I almost dropped all the cards. One, two, three, four. Fairy Energy. There's another Type Null. This Island Amulet, Island Challenge Amulet, is a crazy card. Somebody tried to use it. In the pre-release, they were still beginner phase learning, and they knocked themselves out. Uh, the Pokemon GX or EX this card is attached to does a hunt. It takes 100 HP when it's attached to it. So, if something has 280 HP, you attach it to it. It now is 180 HP, but when it's knocked out, uh, the opponent uh, takes one fewer prize card. So that's kind of the the give off, you know, the give and take there. Still a pretty cool card, Erica. Look at that, each player may draw up to three cards, but you get to draw first. That's very cool, I did not, uh, I have not seen that yet. Golet, Dewpiter, Helioptile, Carvanol, Tepig, Reverse is a Lillipup, and, ooh, Ultra Beast, Ultra Necrozma. Ultra Burst is its ability, three Ultras on this card. This Pokemon can't attack unless your opponent has two or fewer prize cards remaining. Huh. Wow, that's why. Because for one Psychic, one Steel, Luster, Downfall, 170, discard an energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. Wow, that's really trying to get the, the game over. That's crazy. It looks like there's a little damage on the card already, but still a beautiful card. Ultra Necrozma. Look at that. That is very cool. Yes, you're going to go in front of Excadrill. All right, four packs remain. All right, one, two, three, four. There's a Lightning. There's another Great Catcher. Another Dragonium. Dusclops. Flabebe. Sneasel. Natu. Trapinch. Sfeel. Reverse is a rare Zatu and an Armaldo. Ancient Blast. This attack does 50 more damage for each unidentified fossil card in your discard pile. Okay. Mock Claw 100, and it's not affected by resistance. Three packs left. Got the Solgaleo Lunala, the Baby Trio, and the Piplup Blastoise. All right. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna say lightning. Grass, okay. Gloom. Lana's Fishing Rod. I have not seen this one yet. Shuffle Pokemon and a Pokemon tool uh, from your discard pile back into your deck. Okay. And as an item card, that's pretty good. Chaotic Swell. Cosmog. Slugma. Whalmer. Ponyard. Togedemaru. Reverse is a Phantom, and oh, a Silvali GX. Disc Reload. Once during your turn, you may draw cards until you have five in your hand. Uh, Brave Buddies does 50 plus. If you played a supporter card from your hand during this turn, it does 70 more. And Silver Knight GX. 
if your opponent's active Pokemon is an Ultra Beast, it is knocked out. That's it. It's knocked out. That is amazing. And I know that Disc Reload is going to be popular, being able to get five back into my hand uh, once a turn. All right, two packs. I'm going to go with the babies because I did get the Piplup Blastoise, so i got to save that one for last. One, two, three, four. Water. There's another amulet. Another Erica. Vibrava. Nose pass. Snow runt. Rock rough. Deerling. Teddy Ursa with the uh, Arceus statue in the background. Reverse is a tag call. Nice. I got a reverse tag call. That's what's up. And. Another Fion. This is perfect. This is so, that's a great deck. I don't care that there wasn't a holographic. That's, uh, that's a good pack in my book. And the last pack. Am I going to get last pack magic? I really hope so, but I'm not going to be disappointed. If not, because I got some amazing, amazing pulls from this booster box. And as my first booster box and first major opening, I'm quite all right with it. There is a Psychic. There's the red and blue, red and blue tag team. That's a wall of text. Larvesta, Innerinth, or Ith, Rowlet, Phantom, Alolan Grimer, Magnemite, Eevee. <gasps> I got a secret rare Stoutland. This is the second one I've gotten, but it's still really awesome to see. Look at that artwork. Arf, arf, bark. When you play it to evolve, uh, during your turn, you can discard an energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. If this Pokemon is your active Pokemon and is knocked out by damage from an opponent's attack, you may discard another energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. That's just crazy awesome. And Overrun does 110 and does 30 to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Very cool. And an Entai, which was one of the uh, promo cards. Very cool. That is crazy. I got Last Pack Magic. I got a Secret Rare. Look at all these pools, everyone. This has been just amazing. I got that Flygon GX, the Vileplume GX, Guzma and Hala, Steelix, Secret Rare with that Stoutland, Secret Rare, Silvali, right, the Ultra Necrozma and Exadrill. And then from the first half, I got the Duskall or Dust Noir Lycanroc, the Oricoco. Gallade and Torkoal Secret Rares, the Full Art Blastoise and Piplup, and the Rainbow Rare Flygon GX. I mean, I'm telling you, this was an absolutely amazing, amazing booster box. Just incredible. One of the best I've gotten in a long time. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I sure as heck enjoyed making it. Please hit like, hit subscribe. Check out some of our other videos. Until next time, happy hunting, everyone. Deuces.